Are you using rain screens on your project? And if so, what type of rain screen are you using? In my opinion, there's three different types of rain screens. You have a rain screen, which provides you with drainage potential. You have a ventilated rain screen, similar to the one you see here, which not only provides you with drainage, but drying potential. And then there's pressure equalized rain screens, which are kind of a topic unto themselves. And there's very few rain screens out there that are actually truly pressure equalized. Locally by code, I have to have at least a 3 8 rain screen. And that is the minimum airspace that provides you not only with drainage, but drying potential. So cladding, backside of my cladding, there has to be a gap, a 3 8 air gap, and then my WRB. In this case, I'm using lath, but I could use three quarter inch strapping, uh, anything I want, entangled mesh, to provide that actual airspace. As you can see underneath here, we have a core vent which allows air to come in. It can flow up freely through this area, exhaust out the top, water is not held in tension, and any minuscule amounts of water left behind, water droplet, whatever the case may be, it is going to be pulled out via air movement.